Well, Stanvar, looks like we made it to White Run at least. Maybe we'll be able to pick you up some new equipment while you're here. I think I've got some mat, some money to use. Let's uh, let's check out the smithery. <laughs> There's a nip in the air. Cold won't be good. Blacksmith never is. Let's see if they've got any good weapons for you. In fact, let's just double check what you're using. You've been a these good days. friend to me. That means something. Thanks, Stan. You're a good pal too. I don't know how you got down that mountain, but uh, glad you managed to catch up. Yeah, what are what what are you uh just to double check here. What are, what are you good with? Particularly two-handed weapons, heavy armor and shields. Well, yeah, I guess we could give you a one-handed weapon and a shield, I suppose. But now nah, we'll stick with heavy armor and two-handed weapons. That makes sense. So, uh what what are you carrying right now here? Yeah, let's sure. just see what you're equipped. I think you just looks like you're just wearing you lousy want. iron armor or something. Yeah. You're not even... Are you wearing the steel armor I gave you? Hope you're wearing it. Alright. Oh yeah, I gave you that cool sword! Uh, yeah, that's right. Cool, cool. Alright, so we definitely would like to buy you some new some new steel. At the very least. Lead on, then. I'll spend some of my precious money on you, Stan. Don't worry, buddy. Then we've got to find some spell books. That's the other priority while we're here. Eh, maybe we'll do a little bit of adventuring. Let me I don't know. know. If you see anything you like. uh, yeah. Welcome to War Maidens. Hello, Ulfberth. We got plenty of steel for fighting men. You've got quite this looking, quite the scary looking weapon protruding from your back. <laughs> We've got small weapons as well. All right. Maces, daggers, that sort yeah, of thing. Yeah, that's good. That's good. The finest weapons in armor. Alright, so let's start with weapons. Probably not going to find anything better than our enchanted orcish greatsword that we already have. Uh, so I guess that's the best you've got, hey? Alright. 17, yeah. Uh, it's better than steel, but we've already got one. So what have you got for armor for, for my pal here? Uh, there's no way to sort by heavy armor, maybe? Yeah, here we go. Alright. So we could buy some gauntlets. Let's see, I've got... I've got almost 3,000 gold. I could afford some of this stuff. It's only steel, but uh, I'm not 100% sure if Sten's smart enough to put this, this stuff on right away. Anyway, I'll buy him some gauntlets and a helmet. And uh, I think that's all we got, really. You don't seem to have anything else. You've got some boring iron boots and stuff. Alright, well let's try that out. We'll see if that works the way I think it should could probably sell you some of my spare stuff. I did pick up a few of these weird Dweamer things back in the last uh, dungeon, so you know what? You can take them off my hands here. Yeah, it's a Dweamer urn. I mean, it's, it's, it's great. It's good quality. We found it. And uh, you totally should buy all this stuff from us. Just, uh, I don't know what you do with this stuff. Just keep it, you know. <laughs> Look at this large dreamer plate metal. Yes, you can have it. It's all good. All right. Ah, much better. Now I'm not carrying near as much junk. All right. Is there anything else I could sell you? Probably. Where did I even pick up elven guck? Ugh. Let's get rid of it. We don't want it. Yeah. Look at that. I'm I'm amazing at selling stuff. By the way, yeah, you, you can just have all this stuff. Dwarven shields. Now, something tells me that I may want to keep this to learn the enchantment, but that's a long way off before I'll be able to do that kind of stuff. So, you know what? You can have it. Let's just sell anything that weighs too much. Or did I just sell all my steel stuff that I just bought? No. I think I'm okay. Thalmor gloves. I got a lot of junk that I've been carrying around. Definitely been carrying this stuff around for too long, so. Clear out the old inventory, make some money. Look at this, I got six black, blue magic robes. You can take this stuff off my hands. I think I decided that my old amulet was better or something. Can I wear an amulet and a ring? Probably. So that'll be good. Alright, thanks Ulfberth good <laughs> for taking all that idea. junk off my hands. Uh, let's have a quick look here. Oh, that's this one. Right, I do have something better. Okay, I'll sell that to you too quick. You look like maybe you need a new. Hmm. No, I don't really like heavy armor, my friends. Pretty much anything to suit your needs. It's all I've got the stuff, man. I got a lot of junk to sell. Anyway, there you go. 
All right. Until next time. Stenvar. Well, my friend, yes. I've got some new new armor for you. Uh, let's see. Here you go. Sure. Feel free to hand me all the gold you want. Well, it's not terribly valuable. You got to understand. But uh, you know, it's better than nothing. Some new helmets, some gauntlets. Um, assuming you put those on properly, you'll uh, have a little bit more defense, I believe. So there you go, steel armor, armor helmet. Oh, you already had a helmet. Well, now you can choose to wear a horned helmet. Gauntlets, whatever. Good enough. I could take your sword and sell it. Whatever. You can just carry that stuff for now. Lead on. So. Then. I'm not sure when you're going to put you that me? on. Hopefully before we get out into a dangerous area. I help my father in oh look, you're wearing your new helmet, are you? No, never mind, forget that. Hello, Adrian. I, uh, whatever. Stenvar here. Oh, he's not cooperating. <laughs> anyway, what I really want to do is find some more spells. And uh, I'm hoping, hoping I can pick some up here. Maybe... Uh, merchant? General goods? Is there anywhere? Alchemy? Maybe there's nowhere to pick up books in. Oh right! Remember, remember, Sten? Someone told me that there was like a court wizard or something in White Run. We never did actually check this place out. I'm not really looking for any more adventures right now, but uh, I wouldn't mind learning some spells while we're in town. Be glad you're here in the city and not out in Riverwood. Ah, we're fine. Don't worry about it. Hmm. Move around a little bit quicker. Me? I'm totally good. Don't worry about old Blaze. Alright, Stan, let's, let's head on into uh, Dragon's Reach. Seems like a nice place. Maybe we'll say hello to the Jarl while we're here. See if we can find his wizard. Maybe he'll uh, have some spells for us that we can pick up. For me. <laughs> I don't even know if you can read, Stan. Poor Stan. Ah, well, this place looks nice. Quite the uh, architecture. Very, very nice. All right. Greetings. I come to you in peace. You should be talking to my steward. Uh, you don't have to be rude like that. Uh, just sort of greetings. Uh, I don't. Why? Why do you think Ulfric killed the High King? Whoever these people are, I don't really no care. Doubt. Thought it was the only way to make his point, and also because he knew he could. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Well, whose side are you on? I I I don't know. Jarl Balgruf. If it's the war you're referring to, I'm on the side of White Run. Yeah, I don't know why I asked no that. No doubt, either. General Tullius and his friends in the Empire will tell you that I owe them my loyalty, and perhaps I do. Hmm. Ulfric Stormcloak would say that I owe my allegiance to the Nord people as they fight for Skyrim's independence. <coughs> Perhaps this is also true. Hmm, politics. The day might come when I am forced to draw my sword for one side or the other. But that day has not come yet. Ah, I agree. Alright then. Good, good, good meeting you, Jarl. Next I, uh, time, deal with Whoa! Hey, hey there, lady. Uh, by the way, where's your uh, wizard? Somewhere around here? Yeah, hey Stenvar. Too much politics, eh? Probably not too interesting for you either. So, this looks kind of magical. Are, are, by any chance, are you the court wizard? Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, like the rest of the great warriors? Not, not really, actually. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me? I prefer my yes, books. Me as well! Myself. How'd you know? Um, yeah, mostly I just want to know if you've got anything for sale. I may be able to, yeah. Someone someone in town suggested you. Uh, so let's see, any any interesting spells? Oh dear, you've got quite the inventory. Uh, let's see here. Ho, ho, ho. I don't know if I'm good enough to cast some of this stuff, in fact. Um, Jeez, this is a lot of, a lot of spells. So let's see. We've we've got fading blast, feather fall. That's kind of interesting. Uh, a spell to to reveal the target's health. Yeah, let's pick that up. That might be useful later on. I think uh, I've learned brimstone, and that was kind of pointless. Fear and eh, illusion stuff. I'm not really interested in illusion magic. 
Um, this might be interesting. What's this stuff up here? Okay, we got... Alteration, Mage Light. Oh no, we've already got something like that. No big deal. Muffles, illusions. Turn Undead. Hmm. I haven't run into any super dangerous, and I have a feeling this will only work on, like, really weak undead that we could just kill anyway. I've got that spell already. Runes? I suppose we could think about learning some rune spells. I think I have one or two of those. In fact, yeah, I'm pretty sure I already know fire runes. Steadfast Ward. Don't think I've learned that yet. Yeah. Yeah, I haven't learned that yet. So, um... Lightning. All, all the different runes. In fact, we'll pick up some wards and some runes while we're here. So we'll, we'll have all the different kind of elemental runes. That seems useful. Um... This sounds like a horrible idea. <laughs> Why would we learn a spell about something like that? Um, stone flesh sounds like I've got something similar, but I'll pick it up anyway. We've already got the uh, long range version of the elements, that's good. Circle of Scorn. Huh. That's pretty cool. Stenvar might enjoy me casting that for him. It's going to get complicated though if I have to cast buffs on him all the time. Conjuration's not totally my thing, really. Flame Atronox would be nice, though. Battle Axe is nah. Then I'd have to swing it. Too much messing around. Uh, I should probably have this spell, though. We're going to pick up Soul Trap. I want to try out some enchanting later on, and uh, I believe you need a way to get souls for that to work out. Uh, what else have we got? Shields that absorbs damage? That's kind of cool. We've got some money. We'll spend some more of this stuff. Banished non-hostile minions. That's pointless. I only want to banish hostile minions, so... Unsummon sounds kind of lame. Destruction. Cast lightning from my eyes? I like it. We're taking it. Heals me... Seven points? It's like a heal over time that you just cast once. Kind of like a regeneration spell, maybe? Hmm, we'll pick it up. I've got a little bit of more money. I'm getting getting a little bit low now. Protection from elves. Totally need that. <laughs> um, restoration. Disease. Oof. That's interesting. So it's a restoration spell that does damage. Five damage for 26 seconds. I, I'm not sure if this is five damage over 26 seconds or 5 damage per second for 26 seconds. That, like, if it's the latter, that'd be very powerful, doing over 100 damage. I don't know. Inferno, fire... Okay, we're definitely picking up Inferno. Destruction spells sound amazing. And, uh, I... Th Hidden Scorpion. Hmm, 3 poison damage per destruction, but I have to remain undetected. Yeah, it's not gonna work. That's for, like, sneaky mages. I'm not really a sneaky mage. That could do a lot of damage, though. My destruction skill is somewhere around 40, so that'd be 120 damage. That's pretty good. Anything else before I leave? Adds health from a living target. No, absorbs health from per second. Oh! It's just, uh, lifesteal, basically. I'll take it. And kill an almost dead unit. Not that impressive. Mm. Devouring Swarm. See, that one... That might be good for Stenvar, too, because then he can do more damage. Well, I think I've spent enough money on spells, really. It's going to be difficult keeping track of all of my new my new magic, anyway. What I am looking for is, like, a better opening lock spell. We've only got up to Apprentice here. Uh, is there anything else in here that looks... Sheesh, there sure are a lot of spells to try out. Call Lightning, that sounds awesome. That could be pretty cool. Outdoor, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna definitely gonna try that later on. Scorpion runes, more sneaky spells. There's so many awesome spells to learn. Finally, yeah, we're definitely going to want Fireball and stuff eventually. 
Those are going to be good. Chain Lightning Hall. Oh, yeah, Meteor. Yeah, yeah, there's some spells to learn one day. Oof. Oh, Stenvar's going to not like when I learn Fireball. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll save that for later, Sten. Don't worry. Uh, I'll, pick up, I'll pick up the deadly AoE spells another time. All right, let's learn some spells. I already have learned a lot, obviously. And huzzah! All right, so we'll we'll try some of those out. Yeah. So, uh, soul gems. I do have a fair number of soul gems. We might try some soul soul stealing, uh, but first up, primarily, it's going to be about uh, just checking out the new spells. We're going to go find a a nearby dungeon to check out. I think. I'm sure this, uh, what was it, the Magnus thing, the, the, the crazy orb, I'm sure that can wait for a little while. Alright, Stan managed to escape Whiterun for now. Now, we haven't really explored much around here. I, uh, I mean, maybe you have, but uh, as far as I know, you just I just woke up here after you dropped me off. So, let's just have a quick look at the map. I wonder, I wonder if there's anything interesting nearby. Um, could go down this direction towards Helgen. I, someone told me there was something at Helgen going on. I'm not really sure I want to go there just yet. Uh, we do need to head back up to uh, to Winterhold before too long. Let's uh, let's head up this north pass and let's kind of walk up this way, sort of towards Dawnstar, back to the old Arctic Ocean. Yeah, that that'll be fun. Yeah, let's do that. Let's let's follow the path north. So maybe should we follow the road or I want to find a dungeon. Let's just let's just explore over in the wastes beside uh, beside White Run. All right, that'll be fine. We we can move at a pretty good speed. I mean, uh, Sten, you know, he just gets to practice his jogging legs. All right. So what's this up here? My uh, magic compass has a symbol of something interesting this direction. We'll have a quick look, see what's up here. Let's see a fire in the distance. It's, hello friends? Is there anyone up here that, uh, well, I suppose we should save before we go check out this, uh, this campsite. Oh! So this symbol on the compass means giants. Well, we definitely don't want to mess with giants. I, I mean, Stenvar is pretty tough, but uh, I've heard tales of, of giants. And uh, hey, hey there, little bug. You're mine now. And a weird little moon moth. Okay, get back here. Yeah. Got away. Well, maybe one day we'll practice some alchemy and stuff with those kinds of things. Quite the nice evening out here. Look at all those stars, the moon. Just having a good time. Just looking around. I think we'll avoid the uh, the giants. Okay, let's see what this thing over here. My uh, my compass has another symbol in this direction. Maybe this is more uh, useful for a mage of my abilities. I'm sure Stenvar will be along shortly. Probably didn't wander into the giant camp or anything. There he is. There he is. Sten, uh, I, I know you're using the right sword, but uh, are you using the cool new gauntlets I gave you? What's that over there? Somebody's shooting at that uh, deer. I think we, uh, we've we got some work to do, my friend. Alright. Hello, how are you today? I, uh, I'm just traveling along and... Oh, you're not a friend. Okay. Let's, let's test out some new spells. Um... So, apprentice level seems to be the new style. Not even not even very good at this stuff yet. Eyes of the Storm. Yeah, we definitely want to try that out. And uh, so this one, uh, lightning from our eyes. Yeah, that sounds about right. And maybe I'll try like a rune or something. I don't know. Something like that would be interesting. All right. So, bandits, you say. Have some eye lightning. Doesn't seem to do all that much. Oh, good job, Stenvar! So let's see. Let's charge this up. Looks like there's a lot of bandits up here. Alright, eye lasers. Go. And frost trap. I don't know, that's not really 
working the way I was expecting it to. Hmm. I've had I've had better uh, eye lasers. I could say I could say I've had better times. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna run away here. So what am I looking for? Oh, I've got so many spells. This is I'm gonna have to remember where how I keep all my spells sorted. Um, destruction. No, I'm looking for like run away. Where's my running away spell? It's in uh, alteration, I believe, which I've obviously forgotten how to find. Yeah, we're gonna run away that. And then uh, wards. I haven't really used a lot of wards lately, so let's pull out a... also in alteration, of course. <laughs> um, no? Oh, also, sorry. Wards are in restoration. It's all Asians to me. Uh, let's see. Lesser wards. Armor rating. No, I need magic. This guy is killing me with magic. Divine shield. Spell damage. I think... is that the right one? Lesser ward. 53 points in spell damage. Okay, Steadfast gives me like the shield-like thing, I think. So we're just gonna put Lesser Ward on. Okay, let's get out of here quick. And then pull up a ward so we can sort of absorb his magicka. Are, are you actually gonna catch Or... Thanks, Stan. Good job there, buddy. <laughs> he just stabs him in the back. Ah, uh, well, I guess we should just rely on Stenvar to kill stuff. Do a little bit of healing here. <laughs> well, silly bandit. You did not do a very good job there. Alright. I guess he didn't really have any armor or anything. Alright, so uh, Stan, you're just going to go kill all the bandits, I guess. Um, let's see. What what can we do to help out? The, li the lightning eyes? You know, they just... They weren't as effective as I was expecting. I mean... Uh, 11 shock damage at a rapid rate. Maybe I'm just not close enough. Let's try this again. You just cast it once. It doesn't say like how long it's supposed to last. I don't know. Inferno. Oh, I haven't tried that yet. So we're going to go Eyes of the Storm and Inferno. All right. All right. How are you doing up there, Stan? You're still alive, right? You're still... You're st we're still cool. <laughs> Okay, uh, that did a little bit better. Don't you... Oh. Okay, I can't see anything. Kind of on fire. Get away. Run away! I'm on fire! <laughs> Stop being on fire! Okay, pr forgot how to run away properly there. Alright, so this guy, he's not very nice. Whatever this guy is up to, um, lighting me on fire. Looks like Stenvar... Yeah, he's doing fine. How you doing, Stenvar? I don't even need to heal you, do I? Alright. So this was a bandit outlaw. Hmm. Foolish bandits. Huh. Let's try not to get lit on fire this badly next time. Let's, let's practice our inferno. Three fireballs. What do you think, Sten? Pretty useful? Pretty useful, yeah? Alright, let's, let's see what's up here. To try out more spells. Okay, we got some food. Looks like these guys are just hanging out, having some salmon, some grilled leeks. Oh, nothing, nothing. Come on, Stan. You gotta keep. Let me know when guys are coming to kill me. Got a little bit of gold, some food. Whoop de woo. These bandits do not seem terribly well equipped. My steel-plated Stenvar made short work of them. What's in here? Interesting place. Looks like they had a little bit of a forge in here and perhaps some treasure. Hmm, alright. I will take it. Some poison, some more scrolls, right. Hmm, gauntlets. We just bought gauntlets. Oh, wait, wait, wait. That was a magic shield. Hide shield of resist frost. Well, we'll pick it up. Notes on the lunar forge. What the heck is a lunar forge? Sounds different. Also sounds kind of fun. Oh well. No big deal. Just pick up... Oh no, wait. Can't take it with us. 
but we'll take a lunar steel war axe. Why not? Oh, and a book on smithing. Sure, whatever. Could I have taken this with me? Yeah. Okay, we'll take the lunar stuff. There's a lot of lunar weapons here, actually. What do you think, Sten? Would you like a lunar weapon? I don't know if they're very good. Um, while the moons are out, burns the target for 10 damage. Hmm. I guess we can hold on to them for a while. They're worth a little bit of money, and the moons are out, but... I don't know. Interesting. Never heard of lunar weapons before. Uh, I gotta remember all my spells again. Alright, well this was a fun little adventure. I started practicing my spells up a little bit. Just a tiny little bandit camp. Nothing really too dangerous. There's another treasure chest in there. How do we get... Uh, how could one get into that area? Oh, there's actually an indoor area like here. Bandits than Draugr. At least bandits know when to stay dead. That's right. All right. Well, uh, let's head on in, Sten. We'll be fine. We're, we're gonna clear out a few more bandits. 